Queen Elizabeth II has endured a lot of hardships over her more than 67 years on the British throne, but some of her children's behavior reportedly hurt the monarch more than anything. Here's how Prince Andrew broke his mother's heart. Queen Elizabeth II and her husband Prince Philip have four children together. The couple, who have been married for more than 70 years, are parents to Prince Charles, Princess Anne, Prince Andrew, and Prince Edward. In her own words, one of the worst years of the Queen's long reign was 1992, when Prince Andrew and two of his siblings brought great heartache to the traditional monarch. This was the year Prince Andrew, the Queen's second son, separated from his wife Sarah Fergie Ferguson. Andrew and Fergie, who are parents to Princess Eugenie and Princess Beatrice, officially left each other on March 19, 1992. Later that year, on August 1992, surreptitiously taken photographs of Fergie sunbathing topless with John Bryan, an American financial manager, were published in the Daily Mirror. The Queen had what she described as an anus horribilis, or horrible year, and it was due to not only Prince Andrew's divorce, but also the end of two of her other children's marriages. The expression was brought to modern prominence by the Queen in a speech to Guildhall on November 24, 1992, marking the 40th anniversary of her accession. She said, 1992 is not a year on which I shall look back with undiluted pleasure. In the words of one of my more sympathetic correspondents, it has turned out to be an anus horribilis. A month after the Duke and Duchess of York's separation, the monarch's only daughter, Princess Anne, divorced from Captain Mark Phillips on April 23. Not long after, the royal family experienced one of its biggest scandals of the past century, when Princess Diana's tell-all book Diana, her true story revealed Prince Charles' affair with his Camilla Parker Bowles. The book was released on June 8, and was part of what led to their separation in December of 1992. Prince Charles and Princess Diana officially announced they were divorcing in February 1996. But the divorces and separations to hit her children weren't the only tragedies in the Queen's life in 1992. On November 20th, a fire in Windsor Castle, one of the Queen's official residences, broke out causing extensive damage. In addition, the death of her nephew, Prince Albrecht of Hohenlohe-Langenberg on April 23, the same day as Princess Anne's divorce, is said to have hit the Queen hard. And as that wasn't enough, intimate conversations between Princess Diana and James Gilby from a tape recording of their phone calls were published. During the calls, Gilby affectionately called Diana by the name Squidgy and Squidge. The Sun newspaper publicly revealed the tape's existence in an article entitled Squidgygate, which is a cultural reference to the American Watergate scandal of the early 1970s.